Hey y'all, welcome back to a new vlog. Let me just let me just tuck these pieces because we already know what's happening there. That's not really making it better. I don't give a damn. Oh well. Hey y'all, welcome back to a new vlog. It's your girl Show, Show Shauna, Show Glizzy. And welcome to my channel. Hey y'all. <laughs> Anywho, um, I got back from the grocery store not long ago. It is August 27th and today's my dad's birthday. Happy birthday, dad. I think I already did this whole little thing at the end of the last vlog, but whatever. It's my dad's birthday, so I'm going to turn up for him in my house because we don't live in the same place. But anywho, that's besides the point. I got some things from the grocery store, so I figure I might as well just show y'all what I got really quick I went to Trader Joe's Audi and Target and I need to hurry up actually because some of this stuff is melting so yeah I'm gonna just start with the stuff from Audi so I got some fresh baby Bella mushrooms apparently these and the and the white mushrooms are actually the exact same these are just a little bit more mature hence they are brown so if you didn't know now you know and I got these so that I can make pasta with it. I'm thinking I might do it with the um, these mussels that I got. I picked up these mussels and tomato garlic sauce. And I was thinking I could do a little pasta situation. So that's my plan for that. I also got some applesauce from Audi. This is their Simply Nature brand. It's non-GMO, it's organic, all that good stuff. And y'all, I've been loving, I was about to say oatmeal. I've been loving applesauce again because um, it's just like a nice little sweet treat. Like it has sugar, but it also has high carbs, which is amazing because if you know, you know that part of your macros comes from carbohydrates and those are like a very like simple but quick and effective way to get it, so... Let me just, maybe, I need to take a thumbnail picture. I always forget to do that. Let me put this one back in this bag really quick. Also from Aldi, I will tell y'all about these. I got some ahi tuna, some more ahi tuna. They finally had some in stock, so I made sure to get some more so I can like, find something to cook with that. I think I'll make a salad with that. From Target, I picked up the pesto rotini with cherry tomatoes. I love this. This is such a good, um, you know, little quick thing to make. I usually just put shrimp in there and it's like so good. Next, I went to the store next to, well, it's literally in between Target and Audi. It's called Living Well. It's like a Christian wellness holistic shop, I want to say. It's very cute in there. They have so many cool things. So I picked up these coconut waters and I was literally talking to my sister about these coconut waters yesterday and I'm so glad I found these because she said that they sell them at her giant where she lives but they don't sell them at my giant and I like them because the only ingredient is coconut water like that's literally it like some of these other coconut waters be having all types of like sodium something preservative preservative type ingredients which is just like not necessary like I told y'all I'm trying to stay away from the processed foods as best as I can so yeah we are paying attention to all the labels so i got some coconut water i'm so happy and they come in you know these cute little recyclable you know what is this like paper like cardboard anywho i i actually posted me with this on my instagram once and the brand shared me so like i'm about to see if we can get a sponsorship like i'm gonna be posting all the stuff that i buy with my own hard earned money and like show support to these people so they could be trying to pay the girls because the girls is putting the girls on okay <laughs> and then while I was in there as well I picked up some pumpkin seeds like I got like just a little bit this is still kind of a lot for me but I just needed a little pick-me-up this morning because I didn't really eat breakfast yet and I just love pumpkin seeds I know I told y'all I have sensitive teeth but I feel like with the pumpkin seeds I can actually chew them and I don't feel like too worried as long as they stay flat on well, my teeth because if they like are poked that's gonna do something but pumpkin seeds are really healthy for you they typically put them in salads to like boost the protein um, amount and stuff and they have zinc and magnesium 
so I love that and I just felt like picked up after eating a couple of those and then I picked up this cute little panda bear from my nephew so whenever I see him I'll give this to him it's made from 100% recycled materials and it's from the brand Eco Nation and it's just simply so cute I think he'll literally love this because he recently went to the zoo and he was talking to me on the phone about all the animals he saw so I was like this is so cute so I got this for him and then last but not least I went to Trader Joe's of course so I picked up this southwestern chopped salad I've showed you guys this before I really love this salad I'll probably put my ahi tuna in here and it comes with pumpkin seeds and the sauce is pretty good and um the uh cojita cheese is why I love the salad so much like it's so good so I said cojita I think it's called cotija okay whatever very good I also picked up two things of seaweed because I have an avocado so I really want to make like a avocado bowl I don't have any salmon so I think I'm gonna make it with shrimp instead but I really love eating seaweed with those types of things with like the sesame oil and the teriyaki flavors it's just like really nice I also picked up this organic seeded bread that I've always raved about it has high macro so that's why I buy high protein high carbs and it's 140 calories a slice like it don't get better than that like that's crazy for a slice of bread 140 calories like you're doing what you need to do and then I have some peppers and feta cheese so I want to try to make like a Greek salad so I just picked up like a small little thing of olives I never really bought olives so we'll just see and then I also just got some hummus for my toast for breakfast and then last but not least, I picked up the organic yellow potatoes that I bred. These potatoes, like after the couple weeks that I had shared with y'all about the potatoes, these potatoes are so good. Like I probably had these ones for like a good week and they're not even turning brown or anything. Like I don't know, like organic potatoes just really have been doing what they need to do. So I'll keep buying them. And yeah, that's everything I got from Trader Joe's, Audi and living well. So I hope y'all enjoyed that little part. But yeah, I'll talk to y'all a little bit later. Happy Sunday. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I totally forgot to talk to y'all about the Burn Boy album because I have my speaker over there. I'm about to listen to my music while I figure out what I'm going to eat for breakfast. But the Burn Boy album came out like I guess four days ago at this time now. Y'all, what songs do y'all love from the album? Like I love me some Burn Boy. Like, whew, he's so talented. I just love him. But um... As far as Burna Boy is concerned, like his album was, it was pretty good. Like I didn't like every song on there. I feel like some of the songs on there reminded me of like when certain cultural artists try to be too appealing to like American people or like, I guess that type of culture, which is not needed. Like you could just be you. But um, the songs that I personally love are If I'm Lying, which pulls on my heartstrings. I just feel like it reminds me of Bank On It, like that kind of like like that vibe so I love music like that when it can like I can feel it and then I love Giza because it's very much a mappiano music like that uh duh, 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 like that I love that kind of music so much <laughs> Bruh, my hair is really blowing me like ew Ugh, I should just put it in in the back of me because it's just like yo like that's oh well again we're all black here and then i really love city boys i love city boys because as soon as i heard it i was like he sampled birthday sex by jeremiah uh and i love the twist that they put on the song like it was so good and the last two of my faves really for real for real are day play and on form because i feel like those are the most afrobeat sounding and very like that's coming straight from lagos i think that's how you say it i've always wanted to say lagos but apparently because i looked up how to pronounce certain things it's lagos so it's very much sound like they they come straight from lagos with the sound it's just like it's just like very much vacation vibey music to me <laughs> on form is just it's too good. It's too good. I'm playing that right now. Yeah. 
watch me lean if I play with a grandma Swing, swing, or if you're on TV Don't wanna know me nothing to me Good morning, y'all. So happy Tuesday. It's Taco Tuesday. Make a taco for me. I don't know if I'm going to be having tacos. I do actually have some corn tortillas in my refrigerator. I should make some tacos, but I probably won't. But anywho, just got back from the gym and life update. Psych. <laughs> update on my neighbor in the squirrel. So every morning at this time when I come home from the gym, I always see them the squirrel so i guess it's like our new routine so i'll i'm gonna stop every time to say hi to my little squirrel friend and my neighbor i need to learn his name but anyway learned the squirrel's name and learned the little backstory and why he has a pet squirrel he literally has a pet squirrel like that's confirmed <laughs> so basically he told me the squirrel fell out of the tree when he was a baby and they just kept it so <laughs> i don't know why that's so hilarious um, sad that he fell out the tree, but super cute that they kept the squirrel. Now it's theirs and like they've domesticated it. And I also asked like, so the squirrel lets you know when he has to go to the bathroom? Like seriously? He said, yeah. So the more you know, like that's crazy. Also, um, the squirrel's name is Manito. So a little Latino squirrel, you know, keep it in the family. <laughs> So that's so cute. And I googled what Manito means. It's like little brother or something. I don't know. Something like, I know when they say any type of Ito, Ita, that's like like little something. Like Pequenita, something like that. So little, little baby squirrel, little brother squirrel or whatever. So that is just so cute. So cute and wholesome. So I guess if I want a pet squirrel, I just have to wait for one of them to fall out the tree and then I would just keep it. But... That's insane. I wonder if they like had shots and all that. Cause I'm just like, it's a wild animal technically. Like, aren't you scared of it biting you or something? I mean, probably it wouldn't bite them, but I don't know. I've never been that close to a squirrel. So I don't really know what they're capable of. Yeah, I just wanted to give y'all a little update. I had a good upper body day. Like I'm not playing. Like I'm officially only using 15s on my arms. Cause I was using 12s, but like, Look at the muscles, y'all. Like, I have muscles. I just need to, like, feed my body enough. But, yeah. About to take a shower and get ready for the work day. Yeah. Hey, y'all. I don't... Hopefully, y'all can see me. Maybe if I move this back some more. Um, anyways, I'm eating my breakfast. As you can see... See, I'm supposed to be starting work soon. Probably, like, another 40 minutes. But, um... I just wanted to rant really quick because oh let me try to see if i could take a thumbnail picture as well i just wanted to rant really quick because i just remembered i had got this letter in the mail from the mva talking about some it's time to renew my car tags or whatever and it's just like that is the biggest scam <laughs> when you really think about it. like why the freak are we paying for our um why are we paying the state to be able to you feel me drive our car on the road like we're already paying for gas gas is skyrocketed once again and we're paying for car insurance already and we have to pay for this a hundred and something dollars every two years to keep the cars 
able to be driven on these Maryland roads. Like, I'm literally sick of it. Like, I'm sick. Because it's just like, this shit is really expensive for real. So, it's not making sense to me. It's not. Like, I already paid for the car. Like, what the freak are we talking about? But yeah. Hey y'all, so I just wanted to show y'all that I got my package uh, that has my creatine. Now I had already opened it because like I told y'all, I was getting so excited to open my packages. I'd be like unable to wait to bring out the camera until I open them. <laughs> but um, I went to the gym this morning and I worked on my upper body. I actually had a really good upper body day. Um, I did 15s with the with the dumbbells and I like went upwards so I feel like I got a good little pump in my arm today but that's besides the point this came in at around this afternoon and with creatine you're really supposed to take it like right after your workout but I was like I want to take my creatine and so I drank some like hours after my workout so yeah I get the EHP labs creatine it's the pharmaceutical grade and I tried this first like a year ago and there's a hundred servings per container so yeah I had that one for like a year I finished it like earlier this year and I just never bought it again because I was just like I don't know I just didn't feel like buying it at the time but I had told y'all you know I was trying to get bulked up for my birthday type of shit and unfortunately my birthday is literally in like a couple days and I'm like really down in the weight department I feel but I don't know people probably can't tell but I can feel it and I can see it a little bit for myself but that's okay I'm not gonna let it ruin my plans for my outfit and all that but anywho so I got the creatine still I'll be taking it for the rest of this week so there's still three days left to still work out this week so I'll be taking this every day and we'll just see what happens um, I will say I love actually taking creatine like I can honestly say that when I was taking the creatine you know during like last year up until earlier this year I always have noticed a difference with my um thighs and like you know my recovery time so I can swear by creatine like creatine makes a difference in your muscles and yeah definitely take it if you want to also help with like um you know your muscles like recovering faster so you're not as sore i'm kind of sore from my workout yesterday but it's not too crazy but yeah just a little review on ehp labs is creatine because i actually have used it before and i'm happy to repurchase so yeah i wanted to give y'all that little update um i'm feeling really productive in terms of just me being consistent on my youtube channel and this week like today i finished editing the first half of my birthday prep vlog so so far it's 13 minutes hopefully the video is no more than 30 because the only thing I have to film now is like me picking up my heels and then of course um, putting on the press-ons and then filming me get my hair done at the nail salon and also picking up the cake so that's like all in the prep hmm I guess not the cake maybe just like the nails and the hair but yeah, I'm super excited for y'all to see this vlog. Like, I feel like I've never done something like this before. So this has been really cool for me. It's like different. So yeah, I'm excited for y'all to see that. And yeah. Oh my gosh, wait. Wait. Is hey y'all. Yes, I have the same pajamas on from yesterday because I take showers every day and I don't go anywhere. I work from home. Remember that. Keep that in mind. <laughs> psych but anywho y'all i'm doing my skincare right now because it got hectic this morning so i'm doing it now but i'm actually on my way to go pick up my heels y'all are gonna actually see this part like you know the next bit in my birthday prep vlog but i figured i would just vlog this right now because i'm getting ready to go out and after i pick up my heels my good sis Tommy invited me to her little cookout at her house so I'm about to go over there and hopefully get some good food because baby I didn't cook dinner at all and I'm quite hungry actually so she actually you know texted me was like 
you know, they're having a barbecue. She wants me to come over, meet the fam, bam. So that's what I'm on my way to do. And I just love that for me because I could have not go. Like if somebody invites you out, I feel like that's so especially nice. You know, someone inviting you to something because you know, if somebody doesn't invite you to something, that means they don't want you there. Like, point blank, period. So, if somebody's inviting me, oh, I'm going to go. Especially, that's my girl. Like, that is my good sis. So, um, I'm like, let me get myself ready. It's after work. And, you know, it would be nice to be a little social. We're on hump day. So, that's what I'm about to do really quick. I'm sorry if I look absolutely crazy doing this. But, I just wanted to provide a little update but yeah um i'll see y'all when i get out because my camera is actually low on battery but yeah i just wanted to give y'all that little quick update is this not tacky like what are we even bruh zara is really pissing me off right now because what the hell like why is this freaking shirt see-through Okay y'all, so really quick, I'm just throwing on this black American Apparel top. It's called their Juilliard top. It's really cute. Um, I'm gonna go with black jeans. I'm gonna probably throw some sandals on. I hate the pants because why do they have rips in them? I just feel like sometimes pants with rips in them can be very tacky, but I don't have any other jeans that I could wear with this, but that's that on that. Okay, so I found these really cute glasses from Forever 21, so I'm gonna throw these on too. But yeah, I'm gonna switch out my scrunchie for something black. But yeah, this is it. Hey y'all, so just made it to downtown. I'm on a very serious time crunch. I'm literally just gonna get some fries from Chick-fil-A really quick because I know I'm going to my friend's house to get food, but like I'm literally starving right now. Like this cannot wait. So I'm gonna get some fries from Chick-fil-A and then be onward to pick up my heels. Okay y'all, so Chick-fil-A was a dub, um, I'm actually pissed, <laughs> like I'm so hungry, like this is crazy, like I should not be out here, um, I just feel like I could eat literally anything right now, but anyways, the line was too long, I don't know if I said that, but the line was too long, so I'm just gonna go get my shoes and just be on my way, because that was just gonna take too long. Hey y'all, so I don't know why the sound is not working on this clip. Oh, don't mind that, that's my air fryer, but I'm just gonna do a little voiceover by kind of summarizing what I think I might have been saying. So pretty much I got back home from seeing Tomi and her family and I was blessed with some really good food. Like they gave me jollof rice. Um, I also got some mac and cheese and then I was just eating that as like dinner because like I didn't cook that day but it bust y'all like just call me Nigerian because I'm jollof rice <laughs> but yeah um I had a really great time so yeah that's all I can really think of that I might have been talking about but yeah Oh my gosh, tell me that does not look so good, y'all. Where's my fork? Okay, y'all, so I'm about to, y'all can't even see me. I'm about to take a picture of my food because I'm about to eat my lunch because now is my lunch break. Hey, y'all, so just a little check in. I'm eating my dinner. It's actually really late. Oh my gosh, I need to go to sleep. But I just wanted to, I need to check in because I got some Amazon packages, but this isn't like major stuff this is not major stuff um i had to re-up on my magnesium glycinate i recently tweeted that i started taking the actual recommended serving size and i feel like i've been getting really good sleep so shout out to that and then i also decided to buy one of those little electric fans do my limbs work? Gosh. Period. Yeah, I'll be using this tomorrow because I'm going out. But um, let me try to get this on. I got a little fan. Ooh, is she high speed with it too? <laughs> She's high speed indeed. My God. That was really going. Okay, so anyways, I just wanted to also talk to y'all 
because um, to, today I was in correspondence with the girl that's making my cake and sister girl almost scared me because she was talking about some yeah the rest of the balance is due tonight and then you know you'll get you'll be able to pick up the cake tomorrow but I was thinking you know normally you would pay a, a, a balance or like you pay a deposit and then you get well I don't know I've never bought a cake from somebody so I really don't know but normally you pay half and then once you get the the thing you pay the rest isn't that what I've done because I'm like when I got tattoos I paid a deposit and then I just paid him when I was done getting my tattoo like that's what I remember so she kind of caught me off guard but I went back to her email she was saying that you know she expects the payment the, the rest of the payment the day before pickup because she won't start the cake until she gets the rest of the deposit but it's just like if you were gonna do that then I should have just paid you for the whole cake do you catch my drift like it it just doesn't make sense so that kind of was stressing me out because I'm just like bro like y'all know me and how I plan stuff like I have my whole little aesthetic photo dump you know oh yay my whole little aesthetic photo dump in my head like I'm trying to execute a certain vision yay anyway so fan is installed so now I'm at the club or okay but why is the ankle why is the strap this you know what they're stupid because who's this is gonna fall off my hand I'm gonna lose it at the at the wherever I'm at like what I'm gonna have to make like a little loop okay but wow like this is really good like y'all can see it's blowing it's really blowing anyhow and it's so cute yeah they did their big one when they made these little portable fans anywho so she's been texting me now about the stuff but yeah hopefully everything just works out because tomorrow i'm getting my hair done tomorrow i'm picking up the cake but i was really just like so you're gonna make a cake overnight like don't cakes have to cool like i'm just expecting everything to be can i talk what what was that no <laughs> no what was that like what did i just say like it didn't make sense anyway you know i'm not gonna say hopefully it's gonna work out everything's gonna work out but like on a river i'm like you could really make a cake overnight like what is uh a couple hours from now it's like that's probably like 16 hours like i don't know i don't know i'm not the cake experts i don't know but yeah i'm getting my hair done tomorrow i also need to figure out my car situation because y'all tell me why i was having car issues like my car has been having issues starting up like when i'm turning the key it's like doing this <laughs> like this little i don't even know that probably wasn't the sound that sounded very weird sorry <laughs> but yeah it was like this weird sound to start it up so i'm like okay i definitely need to get a new car battery um and like why would my car be on its last leg on the weekend of my birthday like have some respect for me like i'm your mom have some respect like please but it's whatever so yeah tomorrow i'm going to the gym as i should and then um i'm gonna try to figure out that car battery situation which by the way car batteries are not cheap i used to work at home depot and we used to sell car batteries for between i want to say like the prices at that time was like between like 85 100 dollars like on a real real and I called up some places that were suggested to me and they were telling me at a minimum $189 at a minimum. And I'm just like, that's my hair. That's my hair. Like that's how much, I mean, actually no, the cost of my hair is, little, is about like $25 difference to that or maybe like $30 difference to that. But it's just like, what the fuck? I'm sorry, but like, seriously, I'm just a girl. Like what? And then I had already told y'all how the um, the NBA wants me to pay for the tags. And it's just like, I don't need this right now. I'm just a girl. But yeah, I'm really excited to like, y'all not even gonna recognize me. Y'all will, but it's gonna be like, oh my gosh, show like, is that you? Like, duh. But no, seriously, like, it's me. Oh, hey y'all, happy Friday. This is me. Ooh, I just finished my leg day. I feel like I did really good. I feel good, so. Yeah. Yeah, I'm about to go.
set you free. Okay, y'all, I'm about to leave. Um, my apartment is like really dark right now because I made the lights dim. But let me just see if I can show y'all what we have on. <laughs> Dang, I feel like y'all really can't see me. So, light beat necklaces strip on my body. Yeah. Um, coach bag. And I'm going to be wearing my red and white and black dunk. So, yeah. Hey y'all, so I forgot to check in, so I made it down here. This is um the wharf, so yeah. I'm going to be going onward to 12 stories. stayed out a little bit later than expected anywho i got home later than expected and i had a really great time like i feel like i was able to be out in public in a social setting by myself and i was just feeling my own little vibe like honestly ew and then um I'm not gonna hold y'all like I did drink a little something something it was the um whatever that like Korean peach drink is called because I had some from before that I didn't finish so I didn't even finish it I just drank like a good little bit just to like keep me a little calm but honestly like once I settle into an environment and I kind of just observe like what's happening and like whoop de woo Oh my goodness, I was just making sure this thing was recording. Anyway, once I kind of like observe, observe like what's happening, I start to feel more at ease with myself because like no one is, no one cares. Literally no one cares. People are looking around and they're probably trying to figure out how are people here alone and cool. But yeah, um, I honestly feel like the meditation has helped a lot. Like meditation is so amazing, but yeah um tonight was really cool i actually met like a new friend like this is exactly why i go out alone because you never know who you can meet like again when i go out by myself like i'm not thinking about like meeting a man um tonight i felt like i just wanted to enjoy myself which i did but i feel like i also networked like i met some people you know who work in like you know being a dj or like have access to like creative things or something or something and like I feel like I networked tonight and also I networked for my sister because I know my sister's trying to start a business um, and whatever she's trying to sell I think it would be great if she could like find pop-up shops to sell her products so yeah I was trying to look out for her and yeah I just felt like tonight was really cool I keep playing with my hair because it's so cute like I'm not over it I'm not gonna be over this hair this hair um but yeah look what time it is it's 1 45 i'm only gonna get like seven hours of sleep but that's cool because i'm getting picked up tomorrow like i don't have to worry about all that seriously oh my gosh y'all i'm literally trying to hurry up and get ready because i only got 30 minutes to do my makeup i don't think i'm gonna have any issues but like i can't set you up i can't record that i just gotta do it because my friend's coming in 30 freaking minutes so y'all see me when i'm done <laughs> Hey y'all, uh, so I am with Joy. Hi. See, I told y'all princess treatment all weekend and I'm living as such. I've been picked up, we are on our way. And I also have the cake with me, so that's a little sneak peek of the cake. But yes, birthday behavior loading. 
and I'm literally just so happy I'm so excited like today's just gonna be so fun and then you know once brunch is done I'm just gonna relax but I'm just so happy to be here y'all and just get into the makeup and the look and the yeah yeah <laughs> look at my good sis Mel I love her so much and she's here I'm always watching the vlog. I'm finally going to be on there. Period. <laughs> guest star. Special guest. Yes. We're going to have so much fun today. Yes, we are. Okay, y'all. Yes. We'll see y'all later. Yes. Men, they settle. Men think they settle. They don't. Women are the ones that settle. Yeah, a lot of women. No, that's true as hell. They don't realize how much power they have. They just settle for anything. They really don't realize what power. And then they regret going on. If you already see a mistake from somebody else, take it. Like yeah, you learn from me. other people, you don't have to be the one. Everybody's gonna be late. That's what they yeah. said. <laughs> I guess they said traffic, but I don't care. I'm eating. I'm hungry. I haven't eaten. I'm hungry too. So we can get right to it. But um, we got lost trying to find a restaurant, y'all. But it's right here, I think. Me thinks. Yeah, it says Dirty Habit. Yeah, I don't know. Did we pack here? We did. Well, no, we went around the corner.
that. So it's like, what are we, what are we talking about, actually? Yeah, because they're, they're highest, uh, suicide. Wow. Because they can't, they can't talk to people. They can't. Yeah. Even their family, they cannot talk to them. Because they'll be like, maybe they grew up in a household that be like, oh, you have to be a man. You have to be a man. That looks good, Nia. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh wow, that's the French toasty. Oh, the waffles. Thank you. I'm still getting my avocado toast. Eggs look good. I should have ordered some eggs. It's not me. Thank you. Can they close this door? Give us some privacy. <laughs>
Trader Joe's gift card. Ooh. Trader, Trader Hose. Trader Hose. Trader Hose. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. This is actually going to conclude. Or is the lighting still bad? Yeah. This, 
this is actually going to conclude um to this birthday vlog thank y'all so much y'all see my friends in the back Bye. <laughs> yeah this is gonna conclude this week's vlog thank y'all so much for tuning in i feel so special and when i told y'all i wanted princess treatment i got nothing below that so yeah yeah <laughs> don't forget to like comment subscribe and i will see y'all in my next video bye love you guys so much I can't wait to watch.